everyone, my name is Jenna and I am your fifth and final vlogger for the UT Mental Project. As you may or may not already know, UT Mental is a perspective of five students. Jack, Nolan, Roa, Greg, and myself. Uh, it's basically a project where us five students get together and make vlogs on the issue of mental health. And we're basically here to help destigmatize it. And just to let everybody know that we have your back. A bit about myself, I am a fifth year university student at the University of Toronto, Mississauga. And I double major in English literature and professional writing and communication. Um, I'm also a peer health educator repping the Move You crew. And I'm also the Move You social media content contributor on Facebook, Twitter, and even Instagram. I belong to a family of five. My mom, my dad, and my two brothers. One is older and one is younger, so that makes me the middle child. Um, and I also have an adorable little dog. He's half miniature pincher and half toy poodle. And his name is Twinkie. And he's seriously the love of my life. And I literally adore this dog. What I like to do in my spare time is basically hang out with my friends. Watch a lot of really good television like Orange is the New Black, American Horror Story, and Adventure Time. Also, I don't know if you know this about me, but I engage in really deep conversations with my dog. What are your thoughts on the co-curricular record? <laughs> but seriously, if you're serious about the topic of mental health, I really hope you come back for more. Every day in October, Jack, Nolan, Roa, Greg, and myself will be talking about the issue of mental health, about our perspective. Make sure to like, subscribe, and of course, we really, really want you to comment or even vlog us back. This is an open conversation, and we really want to know what you think. So, get on it. I'll see you next week. Stay sassy, UTM. If you're just tuning in, make sure to catch up on the previous UT Mental videos of the past week. Get reacquainted with us. Or you could just stare at Nolan's eyes again. It's really up to you. But just remember to come back next week. Bye.